So yeah, Adam Goodston, who works for Geeks and Gamers, is quoting Jonathan Trent for bouncing the comics article right here. Yeah, Catherine McKill reveals Barbie movie is about how gender roles don people have their human humanity. So yeah, he's quoting this article by saying Hollywood isn't just ruining boys' fun; they're co coming for the girls now too. <laughs> I'm like, I I'm got, oh my god, you right wing liber libertarian motherfuckers are motherfuckers. And and in interview with Fandango, the cast of Barbie talks about what can expect from the new movie based on the iconic Mattel doll. It's one of those things that and not suspecting. So once again you're attacking my girl Margot Robbie. You attacked me when she did that one movie and that other movie and other movie and Birds of Prey, the first Suicide Squad movie. Not really the James Gunn one, does Suicide Squad, but David Zasloff, um, uh, uh, what's his face, Suicide Squad movie, and Catherine Wong's Birds of Prey, the Nation of Harley Quinn. You attacked her there as well. So you basically saying women have to be dumb bitches to get your mission in life. They can't have an opinion. First, Margot Robbie said of the film, it's not just that the movie is unexplored. I think it's the that great kind of put punch it in, in that I don't think they would let us go in. Direction they would let us go in. And I think a big part of that was actually the thing that people find problematic about Barbie, as well as the thing people love about Barbie, and being uh, able to do both with having a about what where the world is to is at today. And then also be aware the this this long six push past year history. Americans at by the time I was done with the script and no Noah told Barbie and they added so much of the and the not so of what she means in how what was how oh yeah how she started as a retro revolutionary but as time went on not so much how do we bring Barbie into the twenty first century and make her relevant the standard of beauty and tuny in the iconic of a woman how do we make that relevant to girls today who did not see themselves represented in the that story Catherine McCall spoke about her retro to reading the script, but then I read read it, and it was of about how growing roles doing people have their humanity, and how was just just needed to be over saturated and it's a very powerful message but what about Ken
Barbie boyfriend after some talk about a Ken which to Rock Ryan means a guy who talks about Bitcoin or play golf lit races races says the kid are, are just characters to their Barbie. The Barbies can do anything. Ken are there to kind of and don't have their own story. And I think that's not needed. A thing I think it's strength strong for men to be in roles in to their gra greatest that is women's barbie doesn't this sound like fun first off i don't care about the kin stuff <laughs> barbie is for girls and women and those characters should be the, the driving force in the film, with Ken taking a backseat to them. Nothing ever, everything has to be made for me, and Barbie is something that shouldn't be it. When be nice if something interesting for men and boys, where it's still making for made for bo men and boys, but Barbie isn't the battlefield for that. But the re reset of it, good God, can't anything just be fun anymore as they to that they have to suck the fun out of Barbie and things into into of the drive in body in images and role and whatever else is off this week I want men and boys to have fun a fun movie for selfish reasons but women and girls should have fun a movie too and if anything of this should be fun it's barbie the recent me of what happened with the new pixar movie it, elemental there I didn't see the film then how can you have an opinion on it jackass oh because they had a non-binary character oh, okay go fuck yourself motherfucker a use but that wasn't a adventure so would things they c could take this kid to see it without any gender stuff from this i'm like what the fuck are you talking about reason amy schumer was going to play barbie in the movie and she left over previous differences which really means that the backlash in the clubhouse Clubless studios to Barbie fans like Barbie as she is in, not as so by femininity about. I'm like, I'm like, motherfucker, you're a guy. You wouldn't know that unless you're gay. Are you gay, dude? I, I have nothing wrong with that, but it's like, you would have to be gay if you know that, or a guy who used to force like me to play Barbie. As anyone could be at after what was said 
in that Fandango interview, Margot Robbie is starting to sound like a troll or a terror horse. As is it, the light in style. They're getting people in the door by pushing a fun movie celebrating Barbie, but one once the light goes down, the starts visiting. No harm is in theater right now. My uh, is to see that movies in that one gets by their thanks to Valentina Comics for hit up on this. Hit up on this. Oh yeah. You you yeah, go fuck yourself, John Trent and Adam Goodson and Jeremy Griggs of Geeks and Gamers. Why don't you go fuck yourself? Why don't you both of y'all go fuck yourself? Because y'all a bunch of Nazi pussy ass motherfuckers that both I'm like, why is Oh yeah, because it's a female led movie. It's like they, when it doesn't go their direction, they call it woke. Because they wanted it to be a Margot Robbie being just a hot Australian chick doing stereotypical hot uh, hot chick things in a bar movie. They want it to be both fun and topical. Because the far right libertarian motherfuckers are a bunch of pussy ass motherfuckers. Yeah, I said it. You're all a bunch of pussy ass motherfuckers who can go fuck yourself. Because why do women got to be bitches? No, I'm serious. Why do women got to be bitches to get you to respect them? Why do women got to be bitches? That's all I'm asking. Why do women got to be bitches? That's all I'm asking you fuckers on the far right. Why you like women to be bitches? That's it. Why do women got to be bitches? So yeah, there you go. Geeks and gamers and bounty in the comments trying to ruin the Barbie movie because it doesn't fit their identity politics cap cult culture war shit. It's an anti culture war movie that was literally for women that had boys in it, aka Ken's in it. Yeah, pussy ass motherfucker. Why is the white man always trying to ruin stuff with their controlling, con controlling ways? Because the white man, it always got to be about whites. That's all I'm asking. That's all I'm asking. Other than that, I'm done.